Uh, customers, uh, let's start by the simulating models <coughs> of MATLAB, Solus, and statistics and study Solus and Simulum MATLAB. So, in the first experiment, I already shared these files with you. So, uh, let's start with simulating model. This uh, simulating model you can search with this name from the Google and MATLAB. You can also download all these models. Names will be mentioned of these models, and you can uh, download directly from there. And you can, uh, uh, <coughs> this your CR can take uh, the next student can take these models from me and just try uh, these using by yourself. And then uh, the results and the models uh, pictures you can uh, share files of this model picture. You can uh, uh, just crop this one and then just. Uh, and this just uh, you can uh, paste in manual like that. So let's start. For example, this solar you can see here. So this one is the radiance. The radius is 1000 right now, 1000, and uh, the temperature is 45 degree. So you we can change these uh, radiance watt per meter square and uh, radiance is the meter square, uh, uh, the wattage in meter square. How much wattage you can get per in meter square area. So this is the solar PV array. You can see the parallel strings are this. You can also change this series connected modules for each string is seven. The solar model is this one. You can change the model also. The characteristics will be different. Open circuit voltage is 85. For example, maximum power is this. Short circuit current will also be there. For example, this one six. If you will multiply six with this one, uh, so uh, uh, short circuit current and this is open circuit voltage. And see similarly I M and V N. I think so. When you multiply 5.69 with 72.9, you will get this one. Uh, I think so. You can multiply this. So uh, right now this is the characteristics, and you can see here, uh, for example, T cell. You can also plot here this plot. So this solar characteristics uh, is this one uh, for this sun power is SP. This uh, the uh, voltage. Current characteristics for 25 degree and 45, and similarly P and V characteristics for 25 and 45. So you can save this one. For example, here you can save. I think so. Save figure, or you can export figure like that. Export setup, and in this way you can uh, save this. You already know about simulating, so I will just uh, briefly explain. Uh, you will change these models, solar models. For example, you can change one, two, three, four models, and you can take different uh, uh, characteristics. For example, this seven series module and eight, eight parallel strings. Uh, and if you change this uh, strings and size, what will be the characteristics? You can you can just change by one solar panel. This these parameters like that. And similarly, uh, uh, the radiance. Here is the graph for it. It is this radiance. Uh, we are changing this radiance here. And you just need to draw this graph for example this one. So uh, this graph, let's run first. I will run the simulation first and let's just uh, run it right now and uh, now it's done. So I will just uh, click this graph. You will see here that let's run the simulation. Now, yeah. This is a radius thousand and then let's change two hundred and again thousand. This is the DC voltage and this is the power uh, two fifty watt approximately or uh, 20 kilowatt power so this graph you will save uh, you can save with any ways uh, and uh, you can just paste in your menu similarly you need a uh, voltage and current output voltage and current this is output voltage and current you can also save the graphs okay so and uh, similarly this one output load power this is the load power 250 uh, i think so in kilowatt yes so in this way you can these three output load voltage current power and uh, the three parameters of the p now for example you can see here that uh, this radiance is this one thousand now i will change this radius you can change here as well for example i will just uh, just 500 and then again on this simulation so you can see uh, For example, now it's 1000, not 1000, it's 500. So you can see the uh, power change uh, also change and 
can see the voltage and also the output voltage current and also the power you can see here it's changed it's not 200 amperes less than 50. but similarly you can uh, check the temperature for example now you can uh, fix the, uh, uh, the radiance and for a different uh, radiance you can draw the graphs uh, it's up to you for example 30 degree the region where the temperature is low what will be the effect so you can see the characteristics here for example for example like that thousand and you can see power what's the difference you can compare the graphs when you will put the graphs you will see the real difference what's the difference between this is only 50 years here it's 50 like that so you can change like that okay so in this way you can uh, this one is this first similar command we only need this kind of uh, characteristic because we are focusing on the pv so other uh, parameters uh, you don't need uh, and similarly other models for example this one is first model and uh, the other model for example here so this model just uh, run this model and uh, you can also uh, do as uh, many as you can uh, we'll do in the panel so for example this model let's uh, run this model no this is not this is there is an error so let's uh, skip this one and uh, this next one so if i run this one this is a simple solar uh, solar cell you can say solar cell model you can say this xy plot here you can see this one pv pv plot and this is uh, vi characteristic voltage on x axis and y axis front and here voltage on x axis and e and similarly you can change for example here the parameters you can change this is this is function you can change the function maybe solver if you want to use the solver so this is just simple and uh, here you can change the radiance this is a radiance 500 you can for example apply 500 radiance and you will see the impact What's the difference like that so these graphs you can also this is solar cell and this solar cell it takes the solar cell and temperature calculation can see the open circuit voltage is this one, short circuit voltage is this one. The radius is thousand because we have just six thousand radius and you can change it from outside. So in this way, this model is done like that. And similarly, if I uh, just uh, another model, if I run it here, you can see here that this model another one. Yeah, here is the error. But uh, here, uh, this model in this model. You can take by uh, details portion for example load current equation how to implement load current equation this is the actually these are the equations for the solar uh, system modeling so you can see solar panel uh, this uh, solar cell uh, load current equation is this one and we can implement this for the i phase np i phase and np just multiplied and how to implement this like that so these kind of things you can get from different equations and this is a good for understanding and similarly the next one for example <coughs> here and these are the different models and here uh, it is changing uh, temperature solar radiance like that so you can also change solar radiance and here for example this one uh, pv power power and here is the uh, voltage and characteristics so and this one this uh, graph is good and uh, similarly for example if you want to see the impact of temperature so here you can see if you run this model and see here the temperature so you can see the power pv for different temperature these temperatures you can uh, in different software you can mention this uh, temperature will be different this different and this different so three temperatures uh, it is using so you can see here maybe you need to find where it it is changing the temperature you can find it here and this is a uh, radius is same uh, short circuit current is same but temperature it is changing like that uh, and it was only three but here it is uh, just changing for example temperature is 25 50 and 75 like that three readings so for three readings the graph is like that 
and similarly uh, if you want to change solar radiance so you can see here that uh, are the solar radiance so the graphs are this one so you can analyze so you can mention the what is this radiance this one this one so for example here the temperature is a constant it shows 300 this one but the short circuit current is constant but here these are the four readings four readings of uh, different solar radiance so 1800 so you can see uh, the graphs the characteristics so in this way you can different analyze the different solar cells similarly if you want to change the rs shunt resistance and series resistance these are also the two parameters of solar modeling you change this so you will see the uh, impact of the, the maximum power point uh, uh, point will be different if you are using different resistance so here if you are, want to see here this is the temperature temperature is constant and resistance you can find it here maybe uh, where this one I think so. yeah this this is resistance thousand and then check it here and similarly wearing r s and check it here this one from the graphs and uh, rs you can find it here maybe this is rsh and rs is this one so these are the three values is taken so it's really good so this model is very good and uh, next one is more parallel than this one let's try this one just run this one model and uh, you see the plot of these two pv and p and here the solar panel irradiance you can change the irradiance temperature and if are different irradiance and different temperature you can draw the graphs another model for example these are the maximum different models for example i will pick here so you can see for example this model PV array and like that. So this is not the maximum need of this one. Maybe you can try the other radius. Okay. So this one not working. Okay. So uh, in this way you can uh, try different models and uh, the different mod mathematics algorithms also there. For example, PV. Outrated and these are the different models and uh, here uh, data is also uh, given for example PV model evaluation PV model evaluation. these are the different ports available for example if you want to use it you have to search out uh, next uh, or future so these also very so in this way uh, for example I also collected some data for example, these I have uh, saved these ports for the drop drops and something like that. And uh, these are the experiments. So I will share this file you can take. For example, PV solar PV system, VA characteristics. We have done this, these two. And next time, maybe with this one like that. Different solars and wind and hybrid energy system and MBPT algorithms and hydro and uh, solar wind uh, combined wind generator. These kind of uh, uh, models we will search on this uh, for the MATLAB. So this is I think so. Let's see, finish this end. Okay.